Hi, Allie. So I thought I was gonna have to make a two-part video, but it turns out I forgot to start recording. So I guess not. Today we're gonna be making jellyfish and you're actually going to need salt this time. So we're gonna start by getting water and making a D shape, fill it in. And then you're gonna pick two colors. This one is going to be like a yellowish color. I'm gonna add in your colors, and then orange. Just splotch them together, let them mingle, do your thing. You can add in more one with the other. This one's not very pretty, but it's okay. It's just a basic demo. And then you're gonna make a little splotchy thing underneath. You're gonna make sure that this is nice and wet. You don't want it to be dry at all. And you can go ahead and add all the different colors that you want. These are not very good color choices. And then you're just gonna take your salt and sprinkle it all over. You can do it a little bit better than that, but that's just how I'm gonna show you right now. Um, then you need to let this dry completely which I did a couple already, just so that they'd be done by the time I re-recorded. Uh, if you want to speed it up, you can always use a hair dryer, but then you just pick off the salt, and what it does is it dries, and it takes up some of the moisture that's under it, and leave these really cool like speckles. It can make a bit of a mess, so you might wanna do it over a trash can. But you wanna be gentle, you don't wanna be like scrubbing at the page, you don't want to rip anything. But yeah, so you can leave it like that or you can be extra like we're about to be. So we're gonna do some extra little designs. I'm gonna take the orange that I used, I might add a little bit of crimson in there just to get a little bit more contrast, a bit more orange, and I'm watching the labyrinth right now, so like, so we're just going to make little swirlies. And then just do some random lines. So my phone was being dumb and decided that I had used way too much storage space even though I've been deleting videos as I go along. But basically where I left off in that other video I was just putting in these lines. Um, I took the darkest color and I outlined my jellyfish and I also made these little swirly lines that go down to be their little like spiny thingamajiggers. And I just did it. I had no rhyme or reason to it. And I went back in with my gold metallic marker just for a little bit extra design. For my blue and green one, I used some little dots. But, yep. Jellyfish. The main thing was I wanted to show you the salt trick and how it makes this speckled cool look. kind of covered it up a little bit. It definitely shows up better on the darker than it does on the lighter one. But yeah, jellyfish. Love you.